can you hear me? Maybe no one's there at the moment. Let me know if you can hear me. Maybe no one's there at the moment. Oh, I think you can because I just heard myself. I'm not visible on the camera right now, but I will be. I have to get... Hey, Simon. I have to get uh, something to bend. I'm going to just try to take it apart and just see what happens. Cool. I'm testing this new chat thing, so that works too, so I can see it. Uh, okay. I'll come over there in a second. I'm going to get this thing to take apart. Oh, and I'm going to play some music. I wanted to play Andras' new album because it's cool, probably. I didn't hear it yet, so I'll hear it while we're hanging out. Where is it? Right here. Why is it showing up as people? Oh, because it's here. There we go. Yeah, so listen to this. If it's too loud or quiet, say something. Yeah. Okay. tried them or looked at them or anything. So it's just totally messing around guessing. Uh, yeah, this thing, this thing. I don't know. This has um, little drum things and a keyboard obviously. It's a standard keyboard toy. Record replay. <laughs> just the uh, keys you play, obviously, not audio recording. That would be too cool. <laughs> um, I think... Well, I'll just take them both apart and start the... See if one looks cooler on the inside or not. Can you guys hear the music? exciting part of taking this apart. A little sarcastic. Thanks, Ben. Yeah, I always really like Andras' music and tech. Milk! Oh, glare, new glare. It's new glare is not a sponsor. It's beer that they make here in uh, Wisconsin, and you can only get it in Wisconsin. It's pretty good. It's nothing fancy, but it's pretty good. What's gone? the letter U. All caps. 
Oh yeah, the music might get louder, so I'll keep track of that. I want to turn it up in my headphones. <laughs> Just slightly in there. Yeah, Andras' stuff is always super cool. He always he uses a bunch of reverb, which some people don't like, but I can't get enough of. There's never enough reverb on things. It's always like his stuff's always his. Sorry, I don't know the pronoun for sure, but uh, yeah, their stuff's always uh super like drenched in reverb and like some cathedral or dark dungeon temple or something. Good. Go to sleep. Whoa. This is like the most boring part. I contemplated taking it apart off stream, but whatever. Showing the whole process. Calp, track one. I think there's four tracks in this album. before I broke it. And then there's like different modes here. I'm not even sure where this came from. Oops, sorry, hearing that in there. Yeah, I just have like a stack. Oh, not a stack. I've got a couple toys I haven't even touched. I think I mess with them. Sometimes you don't get anything, and sometimes you do. Mother screw. Uh, well, there's probably better. The main screw. The main. Forget it. Don't worry about it. Doesn't have a name. It's one of those black blobs. That's so cool. <laughs> Let me go like this. Yeah. See, that's like a black blob there. I'll mess, I maybe mess with it, but I'm gonna look at the other one first to see if it's not that, because these usually are kind of boring. Sometimes you find stuff though. I'll set it aside. This will probably be Black Blob too, actually. <laughs> I think of it, but the only way to find out is to look. It's off me nut again. That sounds like a European thing. Probably means like when you when it's Saturday. Any 
don't even get. bigger screwdriver than this one, smaller than the other one. That'd be cool. Do this in my lap. It's a little easier, maybe. Oh, it's, it's a nice sound. Mm. Sorry, just listening. Ah, that's nice. <laughs> Black blob sucks. <laughs> I mean, I still, I always still mess with them because I mean, there's sometimes you find something, but some a lot of times you just kind of don't. I can still do like feedback or distortion kind of stuff, but I mean, you can do that anywhere. Glock tops. Never heard of that. It's a good name, though. Good. Yeah, I think I've I've never tried. I should mess. With, I've seen people at, like, what can you do? Like, can you scrape it off or whatever? I don't know if DDC was here, he'd tell us, but. I think, yeah, there, I mean, there must be some chip under there, but I don't know if there's anything you could do with it or if there's any way to get to it. I think it, it seems like it's kind of an epoxy or something, which would mean it would be pretty difficult to probably get to without damaging whatever it's covering, you know? This isn't super entertaining. It's just the way it's the real, it's the raw way it is. If you want a circuit bend, you gotta be ready. <laughs> you be ready to take apart stuff, and have it take a few minutes. You can you handle that? Strip it. I might have. Limp. Limp. I kind of feel like I might, but... Maybe I'm not 
not supposed to ask. It's not polite to ask. What? Am I damaging your health? That's on you, man. Yeah, sleep is good. Get some rest, Simon. Man, there are a lot of screws in this thing. Frankly, an unnecessary amount of screws. I'm just gonna say it. I know everyone was thinking it. Just gonna say it. Jesus, finally. Hmm, what's this? Ooh, this is a mic input. That's kind of cool. I didn't even notice that. And it's a blob, but... Well, there's some other stuff. Yeah, it's pretty much a blob, though. I was just looking at some stuff to. Ooh, there's batteries in it. Those probably aren't good. Some stuff to bend, Adrian. That I had sitting. I hadn't even opened them yet, so. I just opened them both, and they both have black blobs, so. Lame. But. I'm trying to decide if I want to mess with this one now or the other one. I think I'll start with the other one, actually. Keyboards are. I, I kind of like them, but they're always, they are, seem to be less, you're less likely to find things a lot of times. Hey. This might be a quick stream if <laughs> all I've got is two blob things. Yeah. Boo. This took how many batteries? Two, three volts. Um, oh, probably the water line, I think. How can I quickly remedy this? Power supply thing. Yeah, I have this power supply, but circuit break my fridge. Oh my gosh. That would be so dangerous. My wife would not approve. metal table, which is <laughs> bad choice. 
when I moved rooms, I, this is the only table I had. Whoop, excuse me. But, see, just work with my hands. I moved my room a little while ago, so I kind of had stuff all out of, out of whack. I can't smell, but I can. <laughs> Doesn't smell too good. It's a bad kind of smell already. All I did is hook up power. Did I totally misjudge the voltage of this? How is this wired? Let's see. Positive, negative, positive, negative. Yeah, there are. Oh, it should be 3 volts. Fuck, man. Hmm. Well, maybe I just broke it immediately. How is this possible? Okay. Yeah, see, it's drawing. Oh, it's drawing almost an amp. down it draws less down in voltage it draws less amps which is weird it should be the opposite I might have just fry it maybe it never worked I don't know I never like tried it before so alright fuck you this thing Small industry, three volts. I mean, what are they making? Little tiny, small things. This one uses 
four batteries. Let me more carefully look at the way they go. Yeah, so they're in order. That's gotta be six volts. If I fry this one, then fuck it, I give up. Sorry for the noise. Don't be dangerous. Tooth method. No. Yeah, minimal industrial. That would be kind of interesting. It's an interesting starting idea. Whatever, like prompt. Prompt. That's the word. Six volts. I think something is fucking off with this, because now I'm smelling shit again. Did I get these reversed? Is that all I've been doing? That's what- oh man, my fucking shit was reversed. God, I think that's it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's- there's the problem. <laughs> I literally have it wired in reverse on my power supply. Super cool. Really smart. Okay. Now that I figured that out. Oh, the music set. That wasn't a very close listen, so I'm sorry, Andres, because I was fucking chatting the whole time, but. I will definitely go back and listen to that more carefully. I'm gonna find something else to listen to. too loud.
someone let me know if the music's too loud? If you want, I don't know. I'm not paying you. thing is kind of broken but just has a bunch of different value pots on it some of them don't work anymore i'm gonna make another one
It's very hard to pitch there. Oh, did I not just hear a pitch? Ah, see, I got pitch again. How did I do that? I'll find it eventually here. It's like when I wasn't touching anything. getting pitch from just touching things.
Hey, Andrea. I... Wonder, yeah, I bumped the... I bumped it and the pitch changed. But I don't know what I bumped. Like, I wasn't touching any cords or anything. It just... Kind of... I was just touching something with my skin. So I flipped this over to try to... Be able to do that easier. Maybe I, I thought maybe I'd find something easier that way. So now I'm just hooking it back up. Yeah, I don't know what I did there. I'm done. That's it. That's cool. Oh. It definitely, the pitch definitely changed. Maybe it's a hi hat sound when you touch. Yeah, maybe I triggered it. I think from these I might trigger, because those all go to the blob, because it's a blob one. Feedback's really easy to get. Let me flip this over again. Creep. Flip it over again. That's interesting. See, that one stops it just from touching it. Which is sometimes kind of a sign of a pitch related. Maybe I'm 
Feedbacks like are easy to get all the time. It sounds cool on this one. This is kind of standard with a blob. There's like you just don't find much stuff. I was hoping that either the two that I had sitting there weren't blobs. I was just feeling spontaneous, so I thought, oh, I'll just take them apart on the stream. Feedback is nice. I mean, I'm, I'll at least put that on there. Like put the resistor or something. This is the first time I've opened anything up in a really long time. I've been so busy with other stuff.
to starve it. Go. Try that. I'm trying to turn the survival fish down. Eh, nothing really. Oh. That's kind of interesting. <laughs> That is down to four volts when it takes one six. But then it also shut itself off, of course. Yeah, I've been yeah, messing with all the resistors and so far. It's I swear I just it pitch dipped once and I don't have any idea how I that happened because it was like when I wasn't really even touching two points together so it blobs all remake it because like a couple of the pots have died now. Why is it doing is that oh just push the buttons over there. <laughs> yeah I just had this old case or something and I just mounted the pots in it put the different values in it. This one's like a switch, so I can switch between them. I have switches for it. Half of them don't work now though, because they're just old pods.
Yeah, I found one cool uh, red feedback at school. Probably about 250k. One point. What? Well, that's all wrong. Oh, this was. Oh. Yeah, that's better. 125. This one's one, and these are just in order, so... I thought I would be. I thought I wasn't gonna get two black blobs. That's sad. I'll have to do another stream sometime where I actually know, or at least open up so I know kind of what I have. Actually, I, I have um, my data corruptor pedal, which I kind of don't like. Like, I mean, I like the way that it um, when it's when it's going, I like it, but it has this kind of behavior where. It, if the input's not over a particular level, it just doesn't affect it. So there's kind of like this gated kind of on-off kind of thing to it that doesn't really play well with <laughs> like the way I like to use like distortions and stuff. And I don't know if bending it. Well, I do know if bending it. Well, Simon has Simon bent one and he has a video on it, so I should go back and look at that. I might just actually do the bends because he has the his little diagram for what he did on it. But, uh, I don't know. That would be the first time I've done something that was, like, expensive. <laughs> but that might be even fun to do on stream anyway. So then if I break my expensive pedal, we can all watch it happen. Me neither. It's, it's kind of scary. Because I, I don't really like the pedal, but 
I like, I don't know. I uh, don't want to break it. Because I mean, I could still sell it. I'm kind of wondering if I, yeah, I might even want to bend it and then sell it. <laughs> Be like, ooh, look, it's cool. Because like, I like to keep all the original functions intact. And I know like Simon's bend of it had like a multi switch so there's actually like a lot of different modes so i don't know people might think it's cool maybe i'll think it's cool maybe i'll bend it and i will want to keep the pedal but i don't know it wasn't like as exciting to me i, I like when it gets going it kind of drones in an interesting way but i don't know all in all it's not my thing But yeah. Ooh, no. Yeah. I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna think I'm gonna try this again though sometime and do more find like I said, find something more interesting. <laughs> but it's kind of fun to see the process too of like you just open something up and sometimes there's like kinda nothing there, so Super, super exciting. Not always super exciting, but I have fun even when there's nothing there. Because, like I said, it's kind of just relaxing. Uh, you don't have to. It's not like a technical um, skill exactly. It's more of just like an intuitive kind of process, so you can just kind of relax and listen to some music or whatever, and and just do it. So. <laughs> I will. Yeah, I'll, have to, I'll find some more stuff. I might even have more stuff around here. I just... I know Simon gave me a, this thing. That maybe I could look at that next time or something. I think all he did, he has like an output on it, I think. Or I know, because I, I messed with that. But yeah, maybe there's something in there. I can mess with it. And even blobs sometimes are cool, but just not always. This one, maybe there's more. I might even poke around some more, but I don't think so. Yeah. Yeah. I just reach for my mouse. Okay, I'm gonna go. Probably, I should go to bed. Go to bed, analog weapon. Because it is. Well, it's only midnight. I'm probably gonna stay up really late. All right. <laughs> See ya, Andrea. And and anyone else who's watching. But I think it's just us right now. Ciao.